Hi, I'm meteorologist Tony Pachock on the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You clicked on the Weather Now link on this uh, late Wednesday afternoon around uh, almost 3.30. Clouds are back in. It's been a very changeable sky. We've had some splashes of sunshine too, even a couple of snow flurries, but uh, essentially quiet. And uh, that's pretty much the trend this evening and right on through the overnight and even Thursday, which looks like uh, a decent day. We take a look at our threat tracker, which tonight through uh, tomorrow, not too bad. Just keep in mind, as very typical after we get some snow, a little melting in the afternoon, a little refreezing of some side roads at night. Nothing really widespread, but it'll be a few icy spots. Uh, jumping up to medium on Friday, this is not a, a storm or certainly not a snowstorm. It's actually rain. Be a mild day, but giving you a heads up on probably a wet, slower uh, evening commute, morning commute looks dry on Friday and, and a milder day. We should get up into the 40s Friday afternoon. So that's why this precipitation would be in the form of rain. Won't last very long. It'll actually clear out later Friday evening, Friday night and actually set for a, a night Saturday, though colder. But clouds still hanging across the northeast. Every now and then we've had a, a few flurries, but it's been basically dry. Here's the wider view and the storm system now spinning across Nova Scotia. A little secondary one well offshore, but the counterclockwise circulation has kept the cloud cover on top of us most of the day. A few splashes of sunshine, but let me take you over the next couple of days. Watch what happens. We put this into the theater and you can see by, you know, tomorrow morning, tomorrow afternoon, the clouds are moving out. So we get some developing sunshine on Thursday. Thursday night looks fine and see the precipitation. This is Friday morning, 7 a.m. approaching our area. Now it may start off as an hour or two of wet snow, but this is essentially rain and especially during the afternoon and early evening on Friday. Speaking of the evening hours, we are, um, are looking okay for tonight under uh, partly to mostly cloudy skies. We'll get temperatures dropping down to the mid and upper 20s by daybreak. And here we are on your Thursday morning. Um, not bad. Uh, looking at uh, clouds and some peaks of sun. Uh, temperatures heading up to about 38 by noon time. So temps are really not bad this time of year around 38, 39 with intervals of clouds and sunshine tending towards increasing sunshine as we get uh, deeper into the afternoon. Let me show you the seven day forecast. Uh, there's your rain showers on Friday afternoon, Friday evening, dry, colder on uh, Saturday. Yeah, a lot of talk. We've been uh, highlighting this now for the last couple of days, potential for a coastal storm on Saturday. By no means is this etched in stone. Now this is four days out. And right now we're giving this about a 30% chance. A lot of our computer guidance and this is the, uh, the position of the storm on Sunday. And, and notice it's actually well offshore. So our computer guidance has been trending east. In other words, further offshore. Don't want to write this off yet. You know, a lot of times we see some of the computer guidance in the long range being too far to the south. And then as we get closer, it starts to nudge a little to the north. Uh, so maybe we, we end up getting a miss on this, but maybe graze with some snow showers. So a lot of uncertainty, but we'll keep precipitation in the forecast. But if this trend continues, and we may actually end up being dry uh, on Sunday after all. So it's kind of the jury still out kind of a deal, but you know, four days out. So we'll certainly update you in the coming days. In the meantime, uh, no big issues for tonight and uh, a decent day coming up on Thursday. All right, that's your latest Weather Now update. Thanks for logging in.